Hello students, we have defined the product operation on the path homotopy classes and now we are going to prove that the product operation satisfies the groupoid properties except the closure property associative existence of identity and inverse are satisfied. First one, the associative property equivalent class F star equivalent class g star h rather calculate this is equal to equivalent class f star g star equivalent class h both these are defined there are restrictions to define equivalent class f star g f1 must be in the other side of the point the other point of the other point f1 equal to g0 F1 equal to G0. G1 equal to G0. F1 equal to G0. G1 equal to G0. G1 equal to H0. This is condition satisfied. I recommend that define G and both are equal. That is the associative property. Then the identities. There are right and left identities. There exists an equivalent glass. For every equivalent class F, this is satisfied. F star identity equal to F1. F star identity is called EX. F star E, F is a path from X0 to X1. Then we define a function EX1 and F star EX1 equal to F uh, equivalent class F. Equivalent class F star equivalent class EX1 equal to equivalent class F. Then another identity, if we set path from x0, so equivalent class E x0 star equivalent class F, here the equivalent class F for the time, E x0 left till for the time, this is equal to equivalent class F. This is called the right identity and this is called the left identity and we have to define the func function E x, E x e x not only e x or not only e x is a function from i to our space is x such that e x maps all points to the particular point x similarly e x not is from i to x such that it maps all points of i to x not e x one all points of i to a particular point x one we e x in a different way e x all points x are in a different if we say pop between x0 and x1, then e x0 all points name x1 x0 like him up in the function. e x1 all points name x1 like him up in the function. e x1 is a equivalent class, e x1 is a right identity under the product operation of equivalent classes. And equivalent class e x0 is the left identity. There are two identities. And so similarly there will be two inverses. Given any equivalent class. Hmm. Inverse is only one and properties of inverse there are two. Equivalent class F inverse ne number denote here. Equivalent class F bar and then equivalent class F bar equal to ingen operate E x naught equal to E x naught. Identity is E x naught to E one only. And equivalent class F bar star equivalent class F Calculate the table. EX1 written. Equivalent class EX1 written. And we have to define the function F bar. F is a path between X0 and X1. F bar is a in capital X. F bar is in capital X. Which is the reverse of the path. Reverse. F is from X0 to X1. F bar is from X1 to X2. And F bar of S equal to 1 minus f of s. That is 3a. Now x0 is x1. So, reverse of the path f bar satisfies the conditions for inverse. Equivalent class f star equivalent class f bar equal to ex0 and the other one equal to equivalent class ex1. These are the groupoid properties of equivalent class with respect to the product operation. First we are going, no, first we are not going to prove the associativity 
after second and the third we are going to go the associated in the stated theorem it is done like that and for that you have to know two properties of the operations star in paths not in equivalent class path la f and g are paths paths ubhayoch f star g de we introduce another continuous function k also f star g de k kuda serthulla onnu rendu properties arnjalana namukku idu cheyan sadhikka let us come to that properties here we are given two paths f and f dash from x not to x1 paths are defined in the space x f is homotopic to f dash means there exists a continuous function f such that these four conditions are satisfied and if you are given another continuous function say k from f f dash to x like if x is defined cheyirikkuna paths aanengil k is from x to y k is a continuous function defined from x to y f is a continuous function k is a continuous function then k composition f path homotopic ubhayoche capital f k composition f continuous ennalladile samshayam onnum illallo then what will be k composition f of 0 k composition f of s0 of s0 of s0 equal to k of f of s k of f of s and k composition f of s1 f in s1 parameters ullu po idinu angane thanne arguments apply cheyam equal to k composition f dash of s and k composition f capital f of 0 t equal to k of x not kuda right side la f illathund k composition f of 1 t equal to k of x not just the properties of composition and you see these results this connects k x not and k x one k is a function from x to y so k composition f will be a path homotopy in k of x not k of x one nu arena y la nadak y la na appo y la k of x ibada x not ne x one ne connect cheyna f f dash ennu arena paths here we have k composition small f and k composition small f dash are functions from i to y k is a continuous function from x to y composition f is from i to x k is from x to y so k composition f is from i to y similarly k composition f dash is from i to y these are functions from i to y composition the rule and such and i to y k x not a k x one ne connect cheyna paths aanu rendu and likewise capital f it satisfies the k composition of satisfies the four conditions for path homotopy between k composition f small f and k composition small f dash appo ee naal conditions eduga k composition capital f ne adanda composition continuous functions ne composition id apply cheyumbo namukku k of x not ne k of x one ne connect cheyna k composition small f k composition small f dash ee rendu functions inde path homotopic ulla condition kittum so state the result as if k from x to y is a continuous function and capital f is a path homotopy between f and f dash they are paths from x not to x1 in x then k composition f is a path homotopy in not in x but in y in y between k of x0 and k of x1 in the space capital y that is the result k composition f combo homotopic to f dash path homotopy implies k composition f path homotopic to k composition f dash ee result vera improve cheyan choichalo onnu lay definition seidha നാല് കണ്ടീഷൻസ് കെ കോമ്പോസിഷൻ എഫ് നെ ഇതിനെ എടുത്ത് അങ്ങോട്ട് ആക്കുക എന്നുള്ളത് സിമിലർലി വി ഹാവ് അനദർ റിസൾട്ട് ദ സെക്കൻഡ് റിസൾട്ട് ഇസ് കോമ്പോസിഷൻ വിത്ത് എഫ് സ്ട്രാറ്റജി കെ ഇസ് എ കണ്ടിന്യൂസ് ഫംഗ്ഷൻ ഫ്രം എക്സ് ടു വൈ എഫ് ആൻഡ് ജി എഫ് പാസ് ഇൻ എക്സ് വിത്ത് എഫ് വൺ ഈക്വൽ ടു ജി സീറോ സ്ട്രാറ്റജി ഡിഫൈൻ ചെയ്യാനുള്ള കണ്ടീഷൻ ആണ് സ്ട്രാറ്റജി എല്ലാ അടുത്ത തട്ടത്തില്
x0 to x1 and x1 to x2 works on again. If x0 to x1, g x1 to x2 and all up again, f0, uh, f1 equal to g0. f in the other point is g to other point. Then k composition f star g equal to k composition f star k composition g. That is the second result. You know what is f star g? This is the definition of f star g. We refer it as an another function h of s or it is equal to f star g of s equal to f of 2s when s element of 0 1 by 2 cross general and g of 2s minus 1 when s element of 1 by 2 1. This defines the function f star product of paths f star g. Then you can write k composition f star k composition g and it is equal to k composition of f star g. Result is easy to verify. The product of k composition f and k composition g is obtained by replacing f by k composition f and g by k composition g in the last definition. And it is like this. Then k composition f of 2s, you know that it is k of f of 2s. And the other one will be k of g of 2s. k of g of 2s. When s element of closed interval 0, 1 by 2, this case, and s element of closed interval 1 by 2, 1, second case. Then k of, so this is k of f of 2s, k of g of 2s minus 1. So f of 2s, g of 2s, f star g. From that we can write that this is k composition. Under the k vata composition at the f star g e kana function hai. k k composition f star g at the k of f of 2s. What is the law? k composition f star g of s. Pokathil n is the end of the term. Composition k vata the k of f of 2s and k of g of 2s minus 1. When s element of 0, 1 by 2, and here s element of 1 by 2, 1. At the function in the k composition, f star g is the same. Now, we can take k of f of 2s, k of g of 2s. This is k composition, f star g. k composition, f star g of s. So, k composition, f star k composition g equal to k composition of f star g. There is a second result. You don't worry about the proof. The proof is not the same. 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 The group word properties satisfy the equivalent class operation star. The proof is not the same. The state is the same. The k is a continuous function from x to y. Then second property k composition f star g equal to k composition f star k composition g. If f is a path homotopy between f and f dash in x, then k composition capital F. f path homotopy between f and f dash in x, then k composition f will be a path homotopy between k composition f and k composition small f dash in y because k is a function from x to y. That was the first property. You have to state these two properties and it is clear from the very definition of composition and the star operation. So you need not to prove the result when the theorem is asked. Uh, and if it is in the last, last section, you write it depending on the time. Then these are the preliminaries for the theorem. Stating only the result, we can go to the proof of identities. It can be given in the next video. Okay, thank you.